Yes, uh, good afternoon YouTube. I just thought I'd show you my little homemade solar panel lift to get panels up on the roof. I just uh, made a, a frame out of some uh, scrap 2x4s I had around. They weren't uh, quite long enough so I had to extend them. used a piece of uh, angle aluminum to uh, join the two together. I think the I had like two or four six foot two by four, so I joined them to make a, about a 12 foot frame. There's four cross braces. And then on top, I put some aluminum unistrut. And then inside for the lift to ride on, there are some little trolley wheels. They make those for unistruts. There's uh, two on each side. Actually, each each trolley wheel has four wheels, and there's two sets of those. There's one down underneath. I don't know if you can see that or not. And then I just uh, up at the top. There's a pulley, and I have the rope tied at the top, and it comes down. To the there's a pulley on the let's see if we can get around the back side there's a, a pulley down on the platform so the rope comes from the top down goes around the pulley back to the top and then back down and then at the bottom I have the rope and there's a cleat so I've got a, a two to one mechanical advantage so I have to pull about um, you know, twice as much rope as the platform lifts. So I have a 50-foot rope, and the, I extended the the unistrut a foot or so past the top of the um, frame, mainly so I could have it up high enough so it was easy enough to lift panels off, and it uh, it works pretty good. The expensive part, you know, was the uh, the Unistrut. I, I got aluminum just to keep the weight down. Uh, the steel Unistrut, I could probably use the steel Unistrut without a frame and buy a couple of 10-foot sections. And that would probably be about as heavy. And then I have, I made a basically a little frame here. There's the platform on the bottom, just a scrap of some pressure treated wood, some outdoor uh, plywood, and then I just have a uh, piece of wood attached to that. And then I just put this screw with a, a little uh, lever. This uh, panel will fit in right up to here. And then I can just put that down. That keeps the panel from flopping around. And you have one panel. 40 50 pounds is about about the limit of what you can lift up with this I could uh, double up the pulleys go for two pulleys on each end and get a lot higher lift or I could put a uh, an electric winch on the top and I thought I'd do a just give you a quick motion video Holding here a little tension on the rope you can slowly lower the the platform down so actually that works good for raising it up because uh, when you raise it up you can pull basically pull down on the rope with one hand and then put a little tension on the rope through the cleat with your other hand and that holds it and that way you you can lift it up uh, couple of feet hold some tension on the rope lift it up a couple more feet and so it makes it uh, pretty nice and then when you get it to the top you just tie the uh, the rope off around the cleat give it a couple of uh, hitches there and that'll hold the uh, hold it in place while you go up on the roof and take the panel off or have your helper up there but I did it a 
did mine by myself, so there was nobody around when I was putting the panels up there. Anyway, it's pretty good. Uh, all the wood is, you know, I didn't, all this wood is scrap wood. Uh, the only thing I had to buy new was the rope, the cleat, uh, the four trolley wheels, the pieces of unistrut, and the pulleys. If you like that, uh, be sure to rate and share the video. Uh, you can check out my channel for some other videos and subscribe for updates. Thanks for watching.